Hello and Happy New Year. Let's talk resolutions. Uh, making resolutions is great. If you have goals for 2019, putting it out there and committing to it is a great first step. I do want to talk about the best way to do that, so if your goals regard health, that it's something you can continue into the future. A lot of people out there think that the best way to change your health is to dive in with both feet, turn your life upside down and make all the changes all at once. And it's understandable if you think that because probably most of the people you've seen succeed have done exactly that. There's a particular type of person that does well with these kind of changes and if you're one of those, by all means go that route. If you tried that before and it doesn't work for you, you're probably not one of those kind of people and making changes all at once like that probably isn't going to work for you. If you've made resolutions about your health, and I hope you have, know that it know that, that is a marathon race and you don't have to dive in all at once. Think about the changes that would happen if you just changed three or four habits in your life. If you spent two months or so on each habit, working softly with it, working comfortably with it, at a rate that works for you, what would your change be six months from now, eight months from now, or even years from now as those things become habit and become things that you can sustain? So if you've made resolutions about health, and I hope you have, consider that, especially if you tried before and failed. Thanks.